hello everyone how are you all doing <laughs> so guys you know i was i came to lagos yesterday i came to collect my passport from the uk embassy on getting here they told me that my passport is no longer in lagos it's in abuja and before i got here they told me it was in lagos me getting to lagos they tell it's in abuja i have to go to abuja Believe me, I never planned on going to Abuja. I didn't even say that I was going to go to Abuja, but now I don't have any choice than to go to Abuja. But guess, you know, you know the good thing. <laughs> yeah, remember my sugar daddy, the one that came to Ghana to see me? Yeah. I just told him that, look at it, look at it, look at it. And he said I should send him my details, and I gave him my details. And this man bought the ticket for me. Now he bought the air ticket for me to, for me to Abuja tomorrow morning. And I only came on this trip with this bag you know i thought i was coming to just um lagos and i thought i would just stay like come on monday go on tuesday so i came with only this bag so now that they asked me to go to abuja since you know that we can't go to a place without getting a new man so i went shopping <laughs> let me open my bag and show you what i went to buy I went shopping this is the only bag i came with then i bought this bag now look at this small box already i have um boxes i think i have about two or three traveling boxes at home but you know we are going to abuja abuja is the capital city of nigeria it's where all the rich people are and we cannot afford to lose any opportunity of meeting a rich man so i need to go get myself this pretty ass bus so girls let me show you what i got i got this cap this beret this is um gold and then black do you know that i saw this cap in accra they, they were filming for 100 cities or so either 100 cities or 120 but i bought it for 3000 naira. 3000 naira should be around 50 cities or so look at it i got this pretty ass cap i got this and this and let me show you another one again hmm. this pretty joggers I bought it for 8,000 Naira. That's, I think, 150 or one something cities. It's just a joggers. There's no top. So I don't know if I should wear these joggers tomorrow to the airport. But I don't know. But let's see. Let me show you another thing I got. All these nice crop top. Born to be well. There's a crop top to wear the joggers. Even though the joggers is a, the dark color. But... I don't really like this whole bright color, so I bought this to match with this. So let's keep going. And I bought this. This is a skirt, a long skirt, and uh, a top because you know that these Nigerian men they like when you when you are dressed decent or very hot. That's what I call classy. Okay, sexy but classy. So I'm thinking I'm gonna wear this long skirt. It's very long. It's very long, and uh, see, and this top and package. <laughs> and then I also got this. I also, anyways, I got this one when I was coming as a flower. This long dress, you know, the Ghana long dress. You see, where is the other one? It's two. This TV should stop making noise. Uh -huh, this one. So that's so, and I forgot. Uh, I got, uh huh. I got some slippers. This slipper is so fine. Oh, come on, try. But that is so fine. I got this fine slippers. I got it for 5,500 naira. Look at it. So pretty. I got it for 5,500 naira. Mm, let me wait till you see. So fine. Look at it, look at it, look at it. I'm not wearing clothes. I can't show you my body on the mirror. Look at it. It's so funny. See? What we're going to do right now, and I got this box. I bought this box for 10,000 naira. So let's calculate it all together. This is 10,000. This is 5,000. That's 15,500. This is 3,5. That's 
19,000 if I'm not mistaken. This is 9,000. That's 21,000. <laughs> and this is 8,000. So that's 29,000. This is 6,000. That is 43,000 uh, 42 over 3,000 and there's something I bought again uh -huh. this is it it's um, Tommy Tommy talk okay, you know for you to look get that coca-cola shape get that cuff like I say you should always package you need that package and I bought this for 5,000 naira making it uh, almost 50,000 naira it's true uh -huh. i know it's true it's for you to package your tummy so guys that is it so see ya when i'm going to the airport in the morning so you see how i look so, i mean i wasn't able to do my videos but i wasn't able to because my mom was there so i was going to upload you so guys i was able to get to Abuja so we're hoping uh, we're able to get the stuff today and return back so I'm just checking with you girls to tell you that we're leaving so see ya when I get back okay, so this is the Lagos airport so let's go there so guys I just arrived at the, uh, Abuja and let's go So this is the airport. Hmm, so ladies, I was in a taxi going to the hotel. The taxi man is taking me to a hotel. But sis, let me give you a little gist. You see that man that should get at the <laughs> this man is slow dead. This man spent a lot of money. My ticket, he got it. Everything, the taxi. He gave me the taxi. He called the man to tell the guy to pick me from the airport because I haven't been to Abuja before. It's my first time going to Abuja. So I don't know anywhere. So the taxi guy took me from the airport and he gave the man money to give me, to buy anything I want. Hey, God. Come and see. <laughs> Let's go, sisters. Hmm. So update, I came to collect my passport, so I went to the UK embassy in Lagos that they asked me to come to Abuja. On getting to Abuja, I went to the embassy, they told me that the passport is not in Abuja, I should go back to Lagos. And you know how it frustrating, how frustrating it can be. I took flights, 75,000 Naira from Lagos to Abuja. Now I have to take another 75,000 naira back to Lagos without getting what I came for. So I chatted with a guy, I collected the guy's number at the embassy. So he said I should wait for him to check if the passport is in Lagos. We have to be sure the passport is in Lagos so I don't have to go and return. So I said let me check into a hotel because I was really tired. Let me go and rest at least. Tomorrow I continue my journey. This hotel, I paid... 37,000 naira. There is no AC in this hotel. Okay. The lady said there is AC, but they don't turn their AC on if the light is off. If they are using the generator. So they only turn their AC on if there is light. See, I'm just tired. I'm frustrated. I'm tired. How can somebody pay 37,000 naira for a hotel? And you tell me that. If there's no light, you won't turn the AC, the AC. Unless there is light, Nepa light, before they can turn AC. So guys, updates. It's night and it's, I think it's, uh, I think it's 11. It's now that they brought their light and they turned on their AC. The name of this hotel is Casalinda or Caslinda or Casalinda. <laughs> I don't know. 
I don't know, but please. Don't make the mistake of lodging here when you come to Abuja. So, um, tomorrow is my flight. My sugar daddy bought me a ticket, so I have to go back. Tomorrow my flight is 12. So, see you tomorrow. Good night. Good morning, everyone, from the city of Abuja. Okay, so it's morning. I'll be going back to Lagos today, so keep you updated. And um, it's 9. 20 a.m. this morning my flight is at 12 so i want to quickly go and polish my nails my nails is rough let me show you how my nails you see it's rough so i have to quickly go and polish it and um i mean look at the room you see how the room is my small luggage i bought they gave me fan but the, the ac later came on so I have to go and polish my nails this morning. You know why my face is white? I was having rashes on my face after my monthly cycle and before I came. So when I came, I went to a pharmacy in Lagos here and I told them to give me cream and they gave me this cream. Pseudo cream or pseudo cream to use on my face. Then yesterday at the airport when I was checking in my bag, the lady called me and said, what am I using this cream to do? I said, it's on my face. She said, this cream is not for adults. That is for kids. <laughs> God. I said, I went to your pharmacy and I told them I want cream to clear rashes and they give me the cream. And she said, oh, that this is not for adults. It's for children. I said, okay, then I left. So I'm just telling you what happened. <laughs> Man, it's been a crazy journey. It's been a very crazy journey. But it's okay. It's all good. Let me go and polish my nails. So I'll see you when I return, I love this place, it's Abuja, it's Muslim area, like you're not supposed to wear a short dress. But I'm just going down the hotel, I think yesterday when I was coming, I saw, I saw um, a spa downstairs, I think, I think in the hotel, I saw somewhere where they wrote spa. So I just want to go check them and see if that's where it is, let me polish my nails. My bum is going inside, this is, I've been coming very serious at the gym and my bum is going. You see why I hate losing weight? When you lose weight, your problem goes. Mm, my problem is coming small. My selling points. <laughs> Guys, after waiting for four hours, our flight is supposed to be at um, 12.45, but it was on to four. This is four to four. This is four thirty. We just got the flight now. Man, it's crazy. From Abuja to Lagos. From 12 to 4, after 4 hours, 4 hours late. But the good thing is that I'm leaving this Abuja because you know what I came for? I still didn't get it. So I think it's best for me to just go back. If you get here, you see a long queue, a long, very long queue, you know. It's crazy. Guys, at last, I bought it. It's indeed crazy. It's a very crazy journey. Of course, that started. You know what, girls? I've gotten my passport. That's what I came to get because I submitted it at the UK embassy since last year and it was delaying and uh, I decided to get it back because I need to travel this year. Did you see that? So I came to get my passport. Another good thing, I've got my damn passport. Let me show you. First of all, let me show you the room that I stayed. Look at the room. It's pretty, you know. It's so nice. And my mom gave me $300. So I went and deposited in my foreign foreign currency account. So I'm going to deposit it. This is a receipt. So we just gonna put that in the trash. So let me show you my passport. Of course, my passport, like this passport that took me, it took me months to get it. I got it. I got it. I got my gem. 
I got my damn passport. I got something. Jesus. So that's it. See, so I got my damn passport now. Says, get prepared for this year because sis, it's gonna be back to back content. It's gonna be back, 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 back content from Nigeria to America, from America to UK, from UK to France to just you have ready. It's gonna be back to back for then. I like I'm loving how thick I am, thick and comfy. Yesterday I went on a dinner with my man, my sugar daddy. And you see, I was wearing this dress. Look, you know. Ah, oh, good baby. Uh-huh.